Welcome back to another 90 Day Fiance Taste Test. I'm Julia. I'm Alan. Today I'm trying food representative of a country from a cast member from the famous show 90 Day Fiance. Super famous. Everybody's heard of it. I'm thinking that we've done most of the good cast members. It's about to get a little grainy. Maybe a little grain alcoholy. Maybe. But this is another fast food edition. Woo! Fast food! Come on, McDonald's! You know Scottish people? <laughs> I forgot you called McDonald's Scottish food. So you have a beer here and you have another beverage. We don't have any shot glasses here, so I use some solo cups. Oh, I thought this was water. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. And I'm gonna be doing it with you. <gasps> dun dun dun! Shotsky! It's not gonna be good. This is gonna be great. It's gonna be terrible. Okay. Okay. Let's start with the beer in case we go okay. for a chaser. Okay. Alright, great color, great bubbles. First sip's always the best. Yeah, you know, you know, buddy. What's it taste like? Regular beer. It's a nail. Compare it to something you know. Kind of. Really? No, it's like any regular beer. Like a banquet, like a course, original. One out of ten, how much do you give it? Seven. Okay. I'll take seven more. It's just a C, got it. Whoa, whoa, whoa. That is not a C. Seven is average. In Seventy percent. No, 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 no. In beer scale, seven is good. It's like a B. All right, are you ready for this? Bottoms up, bottoms up. Did you know that you can measure a perfect shot, the first line? That's what I did. Good job, Solo Cup. Thumbs up. Cheers. Cheers, yamas. That was not liquor. That was like a, a liqueur. So what do you think this was? It wasn't vodka, or if it was, it was really bad. It wasn't strong at all. I think it was so strong. I don't really know the like Sambuca Uzos. It's clear, it's a clear something. It's a clear something. I have no doubt in my mind that you're gonna get this. Fast food. All right. I have to give you a warning. This is spicy. They're all spicy. Every country is spicy. They like spice, Alan. What's up with that? Maybe because there's no flavor if you don't put spice in it. Well, what do we do in America? Just put like salt, pepper, and fat, and sugar? Yeah. You ready for this? Let's do it. Oh, this is like Italian food. E bon, no molto bene. Look at this. It's like chicken and noodles. This is spicy, I see rice. Oh Jesus, I mean it's chicken. Oh, that smells spicy. Oh boy. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that is spicy. I thought that was like a noodle. That's, this is cheese. There was a piece of rice and cheese. Those two things don't go together. You know what this needs? Like a calzone around it. What did you think the other thing was? Like the noodle? I have no idea what that is. Got some. I'm okay. It's too spicy for me. I'm not ready for part two. You're not? My mouth is in pain. This one isn't spicy. Is it milk? Can I get some regular milk and mm, bread? No. Like. Here we go. Here we go. Ooh. These are called glass noodles. Are they? They are. Let me teach you a little bit something. And this is called beef. If it was a hard shell here, is it bippity bop? Is that what bippity bop looks like? I'm not sure. I've had it like once. Doesn't look like that. Mm. And it's also beep and bop, not bippity bop. That's what I said, bippity bop. All right, this isn't Cinderella. Put it together and what do you get? Bippity boppity. Bippity croppity. Croppity? That is good. You yeah. like it? Yeah, I like this. Is it less stinging on your mouth? Anything is less stinging on my mouth. You could have taken a knife and put it in my tongue. It would have been way easier than that last dish. Do you have an idea of a country right now? It has to be Korean food because of Jihoon. I, I don't know. I assume when you did Jihoon, you were actually gonna get like a grill and we were gonna do Korean barbecue oh, right here with some bippity bop. That sounds expensive. And Korean fried chicken, KFC. Not that KFC. I got you. So this food, there are two different flavors on here and I think you can tell which one's which. But... Spicy and spicier. Yes. That's what it is. <laughs> I don't have a fork, so I assume this is my fried chicken. Yeah. Yeah, there it is. There it is. There it is. Look at the size of this. This is the spicy one. It was really good. Is it has it? a little kick, but it's good. What's the other flavor? Not spicy? Why don't you taste it and find out? Oh, that's good. It's like honey. Honey? Mm-hmm. I can't believe there was 
cheese on that dish. Your people don't do cheese. Well, I'm not Korean. You're half Korean. I'm not half Korean. You're half East Asia. I'm not half East Asia. South East Asia. Last dish. The last dish. And this restaurant does not have dessert, so no dessert. So this is a dead giveaway. If you didn't know what country it was before, you're gonna know what country it is now. And what do you think it is? I still think Korea. No, what, do you, what food do you think this is? Was there something more Korean? Bao? Is that Korean? No, no. not Korean. Mm -mm. What's the most Korean dish there is? Well, I'm gonna show you. You ready? This is like the Indian one, right? I didn't know samosas were. Okay, if you don't know this, then there's something wrong with you. Okay, you wanna see? Oh, it's kimchi. <laughs> This is fermented cabbage with chimots on it. I don't love kimchi. They say it's really good for you. I like it a lot. It's just so spicy. It like opens up your sinuses. My sinuses is open. <laughs> Let me bring out all the food. The big reveal. <laughs> what country do you think it is? Korea. For? North Korea. Oh no? Is there not like a 90 Day Fiance Kim Jong Un version? No. For Jihoon and Devon. Except I was hoping some more topless selfies. Ding, ding, ding. Yeah. It's obviously Korea. And the restaurant is called Bunchon. I think I've been there. You probably have. Starting with the kimchi. Kimchi is fermented cabbage with chili peppers. That's the spiciness. I really like it when you go to Korean barbecue and they put it on the outside and then you eat it all together. Oh, they try to fill you up with that. Oh yeah. That's like the sucker's thing. Like when you go to a buffet and they give you bread, I'm not eating your bread. I'm not eating your kimchi. What do you think this is? Fried chicken. Yes, it is Korean fried chicken. One sauce is... Sweet and the other is spicy. I got the half and half combo. This is spicy and the other is soy garlic. Time out, where's my authentic names for this stuff? What is this called in Korea? Kimchi. What is this called in Korea? I don't know. On the banchan menu, it was it you, was you wings. Sure? It was wings. It was. How do you say fried chicken in Korean? Dak chi him. It wasn't on the banchan menu. Okay. I want the authentic names for You're this. You're gonna get the authentic names for the other things, but not the wings. In English, fried chicken. Okay. Fried chicken. <laughs> Ready? Fried chicken is dak chi him. Dak chi him. On Siri, oh, the host gosh. of the show, will not do authentic names. What do you think that is? Noodle soup. No. I mean soup. It's called japchae. Japchae? Japchae. The last food is that. What is that? That is called butthole fire. You're very close. It's called bull back. Oh, fire. Bull in Korean is fire and dak is chicken. So that is fire chicken. Fire chicken. Yeah, well, there's gonna be fire in the hole tomorrow. That's a spicy chicken stir fry with mozzarella and rice cakes. Oh, it's a rice thingy? That's what they called it. Okay. The liquor. Mm -hmm. What do you think that was? Some type of Korean. Oh, oh, what's the, what do they drink? Like soju, right? That's a soju. Soju. Do you know what's also soju? What? Me. Uh, it's called Jinro. And look at it, 7.2% alcohol. I told you this yeah. wasn't vodka. It's less than vodka, but it's rough for me because I don't drink that much. This is nothing. Here, you okay. wanna see me chug it? Stop it. The same company that does this also makes the beer. Height, extra cold. Height, H-I-T-E, height, extra cold. Ice point filtration system. What did I say? This is like the Coors Banquet of Korea. And that is Alan's tour of South Korea. This was amazing. I now feel comfortable going to South Korea and ordering the food. Thanks for watching. Hit the like button, subscribe, and check out our Instagram, Love Is Out There podcast. Also, listen to our podcast. We're covering The Other Way with Ji Hoon. And Devon, are these the four best Korean dishes? What is your favorite? Banchan has a lot of American and Chinese dishes. Oh, and Japanese dishes. So I only picked the, the Korean ones. I found love. I found love. We, we found, found love. love.